In the next three and a half minutes, I want to show you how simple it is to customize your Salesforce Sales Cloud account so that you can use Google Ads' conversion import for Salesforce solution. So let's get started. Assuming you already have administrative access to your account, the first thing you want to do is go into Sales Cloud and select Setup. We're going to add two custom fields to the lead and opportunity object. So we want to go to Object Manager. And let's start with the opportunity object because this is the most efficient way to do it. So we'll scroll on down. And once we select the opportunity object, we want to go up to fields and relationships because we're going to create a new field. Let's go ahead and select new. And this is going to be a text field. So simply just scroll on down, select text. And let's continue from there. Now we're going to have to give the field a name. So uh, very important to call it GCLID and make it 120 characters long. Uh, and I don't know that you need to fill in any of these other details down here, but you, know, you should check yourself. I'm just going to blow through. We'll speed this up a little bit. There's no reason to expose this field to your sellers. They don't need it. And also, you really don't want them editing it. So I'd recommend you just hide it from them. And now that we've saved it, we can see, yep, right here, GCLID has been added to the opportunity object. Now we're going to do the exact same thing. We're going to go back to the object manager, and this time we're just going to select lead, and we're going to add the exact same field. So we go to fields and relationships. Uh, we select new. We're going to come over here and we're going to select text again. And continue. And we're going to give it the exact same name, G-C-L-I-D, all uppercase letters, so that because that's what Google's really looking for. Again, make it 120 characters long. Uh, and then I'm just going to blow through the rest of these screens. And next, let's keep going. All right. And now we can see, yeah, right down there, the G-C-L-I-D field has been added. Now, here's the critical step everybody misses. You have to map them together. You have to say that the GCLID field in the lead form object matches the GCLID field in the opportunity object. It's not enough to give them the same name. You need to make that linkage so that when a lead is converted into an opportunity, it's carried over. So let's go back in and let's create a new lead. Uh, and I'll spare you my dummy data entry here. And we'll cut right to the part where I enter the GCLID in. And we'll just put a test value in here, test GCLID. And let's go ahead and save it. Uh, and now we can see in the details section, yep, there it is, GCLID. Now let's go ahead and convert this lead to an opportunity. Give it a click here. And all right, it's going to ask me all these questions. Yes, please go ahead and create the opportunity. Now let's open up the opportunity record itself to confirm. And there it is, down in the corner, the GCLID value was carried over successfully. So thank you for watching. Uh, if you have any questions about how to do this, I would go to the Google Ads Help Center and look for the conversion import for Salesforce article. Thanks for your time.